Dan, uh, tough result today. Uh, how do you reflect on today's performance? Um, yeah, we knew it was going to be a very tough game against uh, probably the best team in the world. You know, they're, they're a very good team. You know, what else can you say when you play against Man City? And I think we kept the score respectable. And, um, you know, you fear the worst when you concede after four or five minutes. You know, you kind of... You worry a little bit because you know what Man City can do to you. We've seen it, you know, plenty of times against ourselves and against lots of other teams in, in football. So, um, yeah, we hung in there and, um, you know, we got a goal ourselves. And when you score with 15 minutes to go, you, you know, you don't give up. You kind of feel a bit, you know, is there something we can get out of the game? You know, we probably didn't deserve it today. You know, the, the right team won today. And, um, but, yeah, you don't give up. And um, we tried till the end. Um, but, yeah, it was a tough week for us. But now it's, uh, it's the fixtures coming up when it matters to pick up points. Yeah, like you said, they're obviously a quality side. You know, what is it like when you're playing a team like that and um, you know to concede the only early goal? How do you respond to that? Yeah, you just gotta gotta hang in there. You know, you, you know they're gonna come back at you and you know have more attacks and attacks. You know, you's, uh, regardless of uh, what team you are, um, they're gonna create a lot of chances against you. So. Um, yes, um, like I said, we've, we've, we've hung in there and um, you know, changed a couple of things at half time, which I think it was a little bit better in the second half. Um, but yeah, like I said, we hung in there, um, kept the score respectable, and um, yeah, we move on now. Yeah, changed it up a little bit at half time as well, and obviously scored the goal and had a couple of chances at the end as well. So that fight and attitude, is that, is that quite pleasing to see from the team? Yeah, of course. Um, you know, obviously, we know the last few, you know, when the fixtures came out in the summer. You know, you look at the November and early December and you know it's going to be tough. You know, you, you know you might not pick up a lot of points. Um, and these are not the games that define our season. You know, when you play the, the top six of the Premier League within seven or eight games, you know it's going to be tough. So these are certainly not the games that define our season. And, um, you know, we've proven um, we can compete with them. I think we shouldn't have lost a game against the European champions on Wednesday and we gave them a very good game. Um, so we know we can do it and we went into the game today uh, trying to win it, but we also know that these are not the games that we have to win and um, are expected to win. So, um, but we know that it starts now for us, and now it's time to to start picking up points against the team around us. Yeah, just on that, um, it's a really hectic part of the part of the season. Obviously, three games in a week against top opposition, and then another few coming up. Next one on Friday against Brentford. How important is that game now to start picking up some points? Yeah, like I said, you know, we've had some good performances over the over the last uh, last couple of weeks against some of the best teams in, in football and um, didn't get many points so uh, now it's time to keep these performances up and uh, pick up points against the team like I said uh, teams around us and that's what matters and uh, I'm sure if we perform like we did the last uh, you know uh, most of the, uh, the Chelsea game and uh, also the Leicester game and obviously the Man United game um, we'll, um, we'll have a good season and just on for you Dan um, how much are you enjoying being back out there obviously a busy one today yeah, of course. You know, it's never easy when you you know go from playing every game for you know a long period of time to all of a sudden not playing very much. So uh, I'm glad I'm glad I'm playing again now. And um, you know, it's um, like I said, it wasn't it wasn't easy three months, but I stuck by it. And um, you know, I'm, I'm happy to be back on top now, and I'm, I'm trying to stay there.